progressive multifocal leukoencephalopathy is due to an infection of oligodendrocytes by human polyomavirus JC virus. It is characterized by widespread demyelinating lesions, mainly of the cerebral hemispheres, but sometimes of the brainstem and cerebellum. It usually develops in a patient with a neoplasm, mainly lymphoma and chronic myeloid leukemia, or immunodeficiency state. Most cases are observed in patients with HIV, but the disorder is increasingly occurring in patients who are being immunosuppressed for a variety of reasons, including some of the potent drugs for treatment of multiple sclerosis. Other important associations are with non neoplastic granulomatosis, such as tuberculosis or sarcoidosis. The important clinical features are personality changes and intellectual impairment that may introduce the neurologic syndrome. Other manifestations are hemiparesis progressing to quadriparesis, visual field defects, cortical blindness, aphasia, ataxia, dysarthria, dementia, confusional states, and coma. MRI localized the usually non-enhancing demyelinating lesions without mass effect, but there is variability in size, location, and multiplicity. Diagnosis is more dependent on viral DNA isolation from CSF by PCR and on the context of immunosuppression. In this MRI, there is bilateral periventricular and subcortical white matter T2 hyperintensities. There is relative sparing of the cortex, no significant associated mass effect, no brain swelling. The only treatment available is restoration of the immune response by treating AIDS or reversing immunosuppression.